Hey, what's going on ladies and gentlemen? My name is Rage and we are back today with a quick update in regards to some data mines um, that have been actually uh, released uh, earlier today in terms of the game files getting updated. So, um, you know, it's pretty exciting to see this information, um, especially now that we've gotten the most recent copy of the Marvel Strike Force blog post. But uh, what was surprising to me is that there's been some revisions that don't typically happen on a Friday. So very, very interesting. We have confirmation now of Battle World release as well as what the next monthly event is going to look like for the month of November. So uh, if you guys have already caught my earlier video from this week, we know that with Overwhelming Hunger, this was just previously confirmed already in the blog post. So this is obviously going to be uh, for Blades uh, free to play event. But more importantly, now we do have some uh, additional verbiage here on the next monthly event. So it's called Cosmic Awakening. And you can see with this one, you're going to be earning points toward this monthly milestone as we typically do. Um, it listing the, the featured items that we'll be collecting, right? This would be the Cosmic Elixir, uh, Astral Armor, uh, probably a nod to the new Astral Team that's getting released next month, Nebula Cloak, Lunar Scepter, Cosmic Key, and as well as Turkeys. What are these Turkeys? Well, it's a, a nod to actually and a, and a shout out to the Remembrance Day and obviously Thanksgiving uh, activities that happen uh, in typically in the month of November. So that's kind of where that celebration comes from. Um, these turkeys are going to be very similar to the candies that we kind of collected um, in the uh, in the current month. Uh, now that we're wrapping things up, but you can see you get turkeys and the following meta items, and that's going to be adding a significant amount of points um, to the monthly event. Now that's pretty much all I can see here. There's going to be several milestones that reward progress towards uh, the Cosmic Awakening monthly milestone and then even including um, Gear Tier 18, Bio Gear, and more. It doesn't really say if there's any character shards specifically, but we will see in due time maybe if the the um, information in the game files do get updated for that. But more importantly, guys, we actually do have a sneak peek here of the next event um, tied back to this monthly event. So not next week, but the following week. So obviously having some information beforehand is really massive because now we can start actually preparing. So you can see it's called Astral Voyage, right? We're gonna be earning turkeys, which you can be spending in a store, very similar to candy, like I said. Um, there's T3 ISO 8 ions. In addition to that, there's gonna be some Crimson Mutant gear. But what can we do as free to play players to best prepare? Gain progress in this event by spending campaign energy to earn Voyage Orb Fragments. Using Undying Team in War, completing the Stellar Conquest Web Milestone and Daily Free Claims. And remember, you can also, also earn fantastic rewards including the Diamond Orbs, T3S08, Crimson Bio Gear. It's interesting why it says Crimson Bio Gear there, but then in the title, the subtitle, it says Mutant Gear. So probably a typo on their end, they need to likely confirm which one's getting released. You also earn points towards the month-long Cosmic Awakening Milestone, which we know uh, for the collection of turkeys and the Astral Armor, which is getting featured. And this is the, the Web Milestone component tied back, which is called Stellar Conquest. Spending turkey on the fabulous goods in the turkey store and then be rewarded with additional progress uh, in the Stellar Conquest, uh, which is obviously going to tie back to the Astral Voyage. But more importantly, guys, when we looked into the details for the scoring, um, you can see here, it does include a line that says win or lose in Battle World Battle. So uh, just to give you guys a, uh, a confirmed date here in terms of when this date, this data mine was added. Uh, it looks like Battle World is going to be coming in the week of November 4th to November 8th. Um, so a few days in between, depending. Usually it's a seven day event, so it would likely be that Monday or Tuesday. So that would make it the 4th or the 5th. And then on top of that, if you want to double dip on what's happening right now, you can battle in war with Undying Team and bonus points if you have these characters at 5 stars, 6 stars, or 7 stars. And that includes the three newest members uh, being Zombie Iron Man, Juggernaut, as well as Scarlet Witch, her free-to-play event next week as well. So uh, I also want to point out, guys, um, because now we have confirmation that this is a campaign event, we can actually start hoarding campaign energy right now so that way we can make this event even easier. Uh, gives us an opportunity to get more of these orb fragments to obviously get deeper into this milestone, especially since right now we're not using a lot of campaign energy anyways, and you don't typically need um, to use it all actually to accomplish and hit all of your daily objectives for the strike pass anyway. So that's probably what I'm going to start doing. I'm probably going to start hoarding campaign energy right now so that way I can make this event even easier. And remember, um, not, the, not the, the next event, but next week's event, which is the Overwhelming Hunger. We covered this already, but this one's also battling in war with Undying Team. Difference is that this one is building up the Undying Team members to gear tier 17, 18, or 19. So 
a um, little bit different make you can double dip obviously if you have these characters already at higher star levels but um if you're building them up already it's gonna be nice that you can take advantage of some more future events tied back to this and that that's a nod obviously to the halloween festivities but as well um having these newer characters especially zombie scarlet witch getting released next week so hopefully this is helpful guys my game plan is i'm gonna start hoarding campaign energy but it's great to finally get a confirmed date on when the siege on battle world is coming and especially since it's in the data mine files now especially with that scoring uh we will see in due time though this is a couple weeks ahead of us but for those of you that want to stay up to date and obviously preview and best prepare for events like this, uh, this is what it's all about. So I'm going to be doing that, guys. Thank you for your time as always. Let me know what your game plan is and what your thoughts are below. And I'll catch you guys in the next one.